Oh, hey everyone, Spencer Rumpel here for the Northwest Company. Working at the Northern Store here in Bearskin Lake, Northern Ontario. There's something here I could show you. A lot of people have asked, Spence, what do I bring? You know, it's your first time and you don't know what to bring. Hey, I was there. I, I went through everything I owned. It took days upon days. I packed all of the stuff that I was just sure and so certain that I would need. I had, I must have had 12 giant boxes that filled up a whole pallet. They shipped it here for me, thank God the company paid for it. And, uh, and I got all this stuff here. <laughs> I didn't use it, I didn't hardly use any of it. I don't know what I was thinking, so uh, let me help you out. Like, uh, like, look at this, I brought along, oh, look, there's a nice, nice fancy shirt and my favorite vest, you know, just in case you have a night out on the town. <laughs> yeah, right. I make it to the gym or do some workouts or play back, you know. And, oh, lots of books. Lots of books, that was great. In my spare time, uh, I'll do some reading. Never touched one of them. Uh, I, even, I was in, in such delusions of spare time, I even brought a new instrument along to learn. This is a penny whistle, folks. I was gonna learn to play that, as you can tell. I don't know a thing, never touched it. I brought all of this stuff with me and none of it I used. This box here, I haven't even opened it. This is the way it arrived a year and a half ago. And clothing, man, I brought clothing like you wouldn't believe. I brought ties along for crying out loud. You're not gonna need much stuff. Don't bother bringing a whole bunch with you. Every day you're gonna wear your northern clothes supplied by the company. People here, they wanna take you out, they wanna do things, they're probably gonna lend you a fishing rod, help you get some gear, they're gonna do any camping. They have all of that equipment. People are gonna help you out and so here I am now packing it all up, all this stuff, gonna ship it all home, and that I never even touched. Another thing is when you're packing, um, when I left Edmonton, I went out and I bought myself a whole bunch of nice totes like this. This is, this is one of the smaller ones, and then I bought some big ones too, and I thought, man, that's the way to go. You know, it was quite of expense, but I thought, that's the way to go. Keep all my stuff. Be perfect. It's not perfect at all. Total waste of money. Those plastic things, you get them up north in minus 40, and you set them down, they just shatter. This is what you want. This cardboard, this is a uh, ice cream box. I always save them here, and that's what I do all our packing in. Boxes like that is actually the best. It's reinforced um, because it's insulated, so it kind of makes it extra strong. All your boxes are the same size, they're easy to stack, easy to transport. That's the way to go. Ice cream boxes. You heard it here. Go north.